So here is what the wig looks like. So keep it in mind, this is a 613W. And I guess the W really represents that it is a blonde, but it's a lot closer to a white um, kind of blonde. So with this wig, it does have like a yaki texture, but it is layered and very full and cut very nice. So, um, you know, with these short haircuts, they just look like 27 pieces. So there's really not much to really say, you know, about the wig as far as the cap construction, besides that it is a very thick, you know, layer unit, which is really what I like. And as you can see here is the top um, of the crown of the wig. Now the inside of the cap construction is that there are no combs. So yeah, with this one, you're not going to receive any combs, but you will have two adjustable straps. So I'm going to go ahead and I am going to try this on and I am going to give you my final review. Mm. This wig makes me feel like I'm on my third husband. Okay. Hi, I am back with my final review. Um, as you already know, I have the Sky Wig and the Style Anna in the color 613W. So, let me already start off by saying that the stock card is a lie. Because I'm pretty sure if you looked at this wig, you're probably was like, mm, no. But, you know, that's what my channel is here for because I really like to go for the no-no wigs. I don't know why I just do. But I really saw potential in this wig, especially because I really wanted to try this 613W uh, wig. Because I do have a 6113 wigs, but there are different letters behind a 613. And I believe the W really stands for that this is a blonde wig, but it's actually close to a white colored blonde so i'm gonna just zoom in so that you know you really can see like this is like a super like bleach blonde almost white snow kind of wig with a hint of like a yellowish um tint but i feel like it is very pretty i feel like it's for all ages um just depending on how you rock it or what kind of makeup look that you're going for i went for something a little more you know glam 1980s inspired that's what this wig you know was giving me but i'm pretty sure if you swap the attire and the makeup you can also make this wig a lot more youthful but with this one i felt like it was very classy very classy base <laughs> kind of wig i actually did get this um wig from go beauty and why this was actually from one of their sales so i believe i probably paid maybe like 15 to 10 dollars for this i'm not really sure but i'll be sure to make sure i click some links below on where you can actually um purchase this wig now also this wig it says it's a breathable thinness with color flesh as i showed y'all it's all like a yellow mesh kind of netting underneath I would say that this wig is like a medium head friendly. It does come with two adjustable straps and I didn't adjust the straps and it seemed to fit pretty snug but not too too tight. But enough security so that I know it's not going to shift or move anywhere. Um, Let's see what else can I say about this besides that it's just, it's just glamorous okay. It's curling iron safe as well and it does come in a number of different colors but like i said i really wanted to go with this blonde if y'all are new to my channel if you're not new to my channel then you already know when i feel like when it comes to like colored wigs i feel like they absolutely gorgeous if they're more of um a shoulder length or like a short pixie haircut like this one i feel like you appreciate the color on the wig a lot more and it's distributed better it's just my opinion that's how i mean i'm gonna just say that's what works for me but this is also giving me like you know i'm the other mrs claus okay but i don't know if that's just because i got the great background and you know christmas is right around the corner but i think this is something you should definitely have in your wig stock because I've been eyeing this wig 
four months. Like, I was just like, I want this wig and I want it in a 613, but it was completely out of my budget. But I was able to get it within budget, and I must say, it was money well spent. So, I do want to show you another thing about when it comes to this wig. It is tapered on the side, and I will give you a 360 later in the video. But with all this hair right here in the front, like the styles are very endless. And that's what I love about wigs. I love about certain wigs is that when it has movement, you can have the same wig, but you can come out with a whole completely different style, a, a different look. So right now, I just have it... Um, like this you know i have it fussed up a little bit and then i kind of like patted it down because you can actually give this wig a lot of height but i didn't really wanted it like i really didn't want it like too tall and ace ventura ish but i want to take a look at the stock card i want to see how it's styled okay so this is how it looks out on the card so i'm gonna try to go for this look so I'm going to possibly lift this up, take some curls, because these um, layered curls are beautiful, like, okay, let's see, let's see how this goes, okay. I'm going to give y'all some options for when y'all get this wig. Okay, so this is sharp. This is this is kind of like hold on, I'm trying to find it, y'all. This is uh kind of kind of like how the stock card looks. So it's not bad. So let's try something else. So if you flip it, fluff it all to one side. Here you go. You have another style. You know. And you will get some shedding. As you can see, there are certain hairs um, that are flying down. But I always expect that when you get a blonde unit. So that's cute. That's another style. Now, if you want to, um, let's say if you kind of want to, like, really, really mohawk it. You know, you could do that. So that's another look. Now, if you want to just do it like how I did, just bring it, just do my fingers like this. You can do it like that. And give you like this flat, like messy curl look. There's another look that you can go for. And I'm going to take a picture. Okay. Or you can make it um, just kind of big and fluffy. Just give it, um, you know, just some more height. And you can play with the curls just a little bit more. Because it's a gorgeous wig. Very versatile. And the, see, the thing with certain short wigs... Just because they're short, it doesn't mean you have to wear them one way, obviously. And you don't necessarily have to get this color, but if you're daring like me, definitely go for this uh, this white 6113 because I feel like it's a must-have. Another thing, I feel, like this wig, you know me and my wigs, they give me a whole personality. Like I feel like this is the kind of wig, you know, when you go to a Christmas party and you just got to bring out the fur. Okay, you just got to do one of these real quick, <laughs> you know, let the other people at the party whisper about you. They'd be like, mm, they'll go bar. I heard she was on her third husband. Y'all know how some of these parties be. <laughs> I feel like, uh, yes, shoot, I feel like 
I used to hang out with little Kim back in the day. That's what I feel like. Or that me and a cookie off the empire used to hustle in these streets together, but y'all ain't know that. Yeah. Okay. I'm get I'm giving y'all options. Okay, I'm giving y'all style, I'm giving y'all fashion, and I'm okay. Just go ahead and click that subscribe button. I don't know what y'all waiting for. So, I know what y'all waiting for. Y'all waiting for the 360. So, let me go ahead and show you the 360 review. You already seen the front of the hair. Now, this is how it looks on the right side. It's I think it's very nice. And it's uh, you could taper it some more, you know, if you put a scarf on it. But this is just, you know, freshly out the pack. So, so here's the right side. Here's the back. Um, the wig is not bulky. I just have two um, braids in the back, and this is um, seems to be sticking out, so that's the only reason why. But I feel like the cut in the back is very gorgeous. And I also like how the tail end of the tapering curls up, giving it more of a flare. And this is how it looks on the left side. And as you can see, the flips in the back. So... This wig is an all-inclusive wig. I feel like you could, I feel like this is an all-year-round wig because it's short enough for the summertime, and I feel like it definitely gives you that holiday look for the fall and wintertime. So if you like this review, you know, let me know in the comment section below. Make sure you also like, share, and subscribe. And if you get this wig because of me, let me know. So until then, stay beautiful. And I will come back to you with another, another sleigh. So I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to take some pictures. So until then, bye.